The Big Easy is still struggling to recover from this epic disaster. Eyewitness News reporter George Panacchio is live in Los Angeles, where people close to the tragedy of Katrina gathered for a premiere of a movie with a message. George? Thank you very much. You know, the federal government does say it is living up to its responsibility in helping New Orleans recover. But tonight, a film less than five minutes long, and people who've seen the devastation firsthand just aren't buying it. We live in the greatest country in the world. We can put a man on a moon, but we can't put a family back in their house. Two years after Hurricane Katrina damaged much of the Gulf Coast, a film just a few minutes long is hoping to make a different kind of impact on YouTube. When the Saints Go Marching In aims to call attention to the victims of the hurricane while urging the Senate to pass the Gulf Coast Recovery Bill. And what I say is, look, hear these voices, and then most important, do something, because that's the beauty of democracy. This is better than two years. And nothing ever been done. Nothing ever been done. At Cafe Club Fedodo in Mid City, a packed house came out to support the movie and what it is trying to do. Eric B. lived through Hurricane Katrina. It still is horrible. It was a horrible event, and we need to wake up. The American people showed nothing but love. The American government let us down. Monique Guild wanted to be here to support the film. Her brother, her sister, and her father all lost their homes to Katrina. She returned to the place she once called home just last Christmas. I felt like I was in a Mad Max movie. People are desperate there. They need food, they need water, they, they need supplies, and you know, they rush your car, and it's only out of desperation. Katrina continues to wreak emotional damage. I'm sorry. I'm I'm getting emotional, but I just can't believe that there's a place like, you know, like New Orleans or anywhere in the nation that would be subject to this two years later. The feds have suggested that state and local leaders just aren't doing enough to put federal dollars to good use. Now here at the club, they're going to start offering a New Orleans music and food night with part of the benefits going to the victims of Hurricane Katrina. We're live in Los Angeles, George Pinocchio, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Okay, thank you very much for that, George.